Hey Paris, what's happening? What is happening, you all? Blessed Wednesday morning from my Jamaican home to wherever you are. Welcome once more to the Jamaican Debited Stream. You know, I hope you're having. Well, we're not having a good time, you know, but I hope you're blessed, staying safe. You know, just trying to be positive and all of that. Just circle up yourself, circle up your nerves and all of that. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and most of all, you know I would like it to be good night when you cock up in your bed and you watch Debbie Dunga Yard. Yeah. This is the time, if you don't have nothing to do inside, you just cock up your work. You know, everywhere speak and spam because you've been quarantined for how many weeks or maybe more than a month now. Okay? So, on this episode of the Jamaican Debbie Deb Strain, I'm going to be sharing with you something that you can use to power up your nerves, something to settle your nerves. When your nerves is strong, you're sickly, your body's sickly. You know, easy to forget, you know? For just calm down your nerves. So I'll be introducing to you today one of my to be signature juice drink for the Jamaican Debbie Debs train. Remember in my prior last video, I told you that the five star backyard is still in swing. It's just that we are gonna name it a little bit different. It's gonna be the Jamaican five star dash yard, not backyard. But I'll tell you, I'm telling you something I thought the out the bag just yet. So, a lot of you wanna come, you wanna dine, you wanna have juice, you wanna have all of the Jamaican niceness, then where you see me prepare on the cooking journey. You want to get a taste, you want to get a feel, you want to know if me for real, you want to know if these things that I'm preparing, if they are for real, if them work out. So we are working on that for you, okay? And as me tell you said, this will go on, it kind of slow things, but we are trying, we are trying our best, you know? We are trying our best. So now, I'll be sharing one of you as I, one of my to, um, to be signature drink. You'll be getting some of the, this and others for power up yourself. Today, I'm going to be mixing for you some sour sap and guava. A sour sap and guava thing to settle your nerves. Yes, guava can make juice, you know too. And look here, they have guava in tea bags here in Jamaica. You have guava tea bag in the supermarkets. Mm -hmm. It's not all, and everything negative about Jamaica. There are a lot of positive things going on here, you know. And that is why when you come to visit me, and I start taking you around, you will see we have lots of positivity. Yeah, me know some little things I would like to change, but as time go by. Now, you want to get yourself some guava. I got these ahead of time and they were frozen. So, I got some ripe ones. You want to get some ripe ones. These are ripe. So, I have the, um, these were washed and um, frozen. So, what you want to do, you could do it ahead of time by wash, hold them wash them chop them and freeze them but i just got to wash these i didn't get to hold them and when i say hold means you're gonna take out this at part any fruit that have them little stem here that's what i think hold means and you're gonna nip off down by the little bottom there these were washed already and if you see any little thing you know so you want to get it like that and because it was frozen these are the nice ones inside of them pink yeah so you want to chop them but you could do this ahead of time when you just get the guavas Wash them, hold them, take out those little, little stem and navel and all of them little part there. You want to take them out and wash and chop and freeze them. Guava is a very powerful, strong fruit. And I promise you a story on my nervous breakdown. I hope to hold it off a bit because people are going, this time that we are going through, I don't think it is the right time to be sharing that story because it's a story that will... Make somebody that maybe a, a few people that are going through that, will, it will make them sad. So I don't, it's, it's something that is sad. When it comes to your nerves and getting all weak out, it's a very sad thing. So I'm holding it, things still step up back again. So I'll be making right here some sour sap and guava. It's a little tonic, a little nice juice for your nerves. So this is all boiled water. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to put in it on my blender and I'm going to be getting it all blended out i'm just gonna put it on to liquefy and get it all whipped out oh i am not plugged in here family soon come and liquefy
You saw me put in three small or medium, I would say medium guavas. And this is what it looks like. What you're going to do now, you are going to leave it through the run through your strainer. Look at the thickness. Look at that thickness. So you want to get some nice guavas. Because not all of them as it thick like this. Like I said to you, not all the sour saps are the same nature. Some of them depend a little more warpy side, just like the guavas. Okay? So we're leaving that to drip out and we soon come. Okay, we are back. You want to rinse your jug because this guava has a lot of sediments. So you want to rinse your blender jug, right? After you do this. Now, you shake it through. This is what you have. Look at it. Okay? But even though it's like this, it is of the nature that you will want to put it through here to get a really smooth drink. The sauce sap is really smooth, you know, as you know, those of you who are familiar with sauce sap. The sauce sap juice is really smooth. And the guava can be smooth too. But in order for it to be sedimentary, to look fine free, you got to put it through your cheesecloth. So you want to go now and you want to put it through your cheesecloth. Wow. Try to make sure that it not go down in there. Figure too much work. You want to have it right round. Yeah. So you want to put it through your cheesecloth and let it stay there until everything trips right out you could to give it a little push through with your spoon so it's gonna take a little time so we are gonna get it all through the cheesecloth and we are gonna come back to you this is a special drink for your nerves and this is one I want me to share because look here if you don't get it where you are when you come by me and once you want it you will get it okay must soon come okay now Paris this is what we got from the guava this is the left back where you know one taste in your mouth that's why you must have the cheese cloth you don't want to taste this that is too annoying whilst drinking now we want to come to the salsa yeah who is gonna tell me Debbie me can but i mean i have no time for them something then. you gotta have time for yourself paris you need especially when you reach my age you must make time for yourselves. Nothing is too time consuming for your body. Okay, Paris? All right. You want to get the sauce up like this. You want to fit, find yourself some time. And you want to get the sauce up like this. You want to take out all the seeds. So you want to have the seeds one side. And this is all pulp. Okay? And don't talk about... Because you don't have to do a whole lot. Kind of like you make it for sale. You can just do a small sauce up or half of a sauce up. So you just want to get all the seeds out. I hope you are following what I'm saying. And you're not talking about the chat too much. And then when you see what is happening, then you go and ask me what you to do or what you're not to do. Now we're going to use this guava juice to put inside here. Okay? We're going to come right here now. And we're going to go back on our blender. And now we're going to puree out this thing. Eh? puree for about two minutes may soon come okay now family after two minutes of pureeing this is what you will have with the guava and the sour sap bulbs you want to add some lime lemon or some whatever citrus juice i'm using sour orange also for me i'm going to be adding a little brown sugar you could add some honey some natural honey, which is more healthy. May I use a little brown sugar? And who is ever is going to say, don't use it, use agave. I know nothing about agave. I know about brown sugar. You also want to add a few cubes of ice, okay? If you don't want ice, you can easily leave it out. Whatever I had here in the last, if you don't want it to, you can leave it. You don't have to. The sugar is not compulsory. The lemon juice is compulsory. The ice and the sugar, they are not compulsory. So I want to go back again and we want to puree some more to get that those ice cubes all sorted out. Masuko. So now, after pureeing with the ice, the sugar, and the citrus juice, which is sour orange, well, probably lime or lemon, wherever you are, if you can't get sour orange, this is what you'll have. I'm pouring it to let you see it. 
this is what you will have you want to know just for presentation you want to add um, I am just going to add a little piece of a sprig of mint wow why are we making a mess right there and you just want to get your straw in and I chose to use the ice cubes because I want you to get it all cool and nice in this at time coming up this is your perfect drink for to power up your body your nerves you work so hard you have been you have been having this like a tingling like a tingling in your body all over all of here this is for you the sauce up is good for your nerves I've told you sauce up leave the guava the guava leaf too but let me tell you you will hear about the guava leaf in my story of my nervous breakdown I'll wait until this time is fast. I'm not really want to give a sad story right now. Story, no sad story time now. So look here. I don't want you to think that I am not drinking it. Because this is going to be for me and dad. Come on, girl. I want to pour out. Then yo. And I want to listen to some of the young ones. They want it too. Because they study hard. Some of them. Right here in this one. You have gotten every single thing. From the sour sap. Mm? you need to try it when you try it please let me know don't tell me you don't have the time i've got a mustache here no problem so this is what i have for you today on the jamaican debbie deb stream make sure you stay subscribed make sure when you do subscribe you hit the notification bell press that option all the jamaican debbie deb strain pirates it's going places try not to be left out and it doesn't matter what we do right on over here Never let the evil around you. Never let it take control of you. Steer, Panta Patins.